Hello and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. So Binance has extended zero fee Bitcoin trading globally. So they're not done just by owning their US competitors. They want to pwn their uh, international competitors as well. So they're going to have zero fee Bitcoin trading, which is going to put the pressure on other exchanges because Binance is planning to make money not off trading fees, um, or anything like that, but they're going to make money off of staking and other services. We know that Binance offers high leverage trading and once people get liquidated and destroyed, they make money off of that. And they probably make more money off of that than anything else. So their trading fees are probably nominal in their overall, um, basically, profit scheme. So they started with Binance.us and now they're going to roll out with Binance.com. So if you're trading Bitcoin on Binance, well, then it's going to be free. But I think it only is Bitcoin. It doesn't extend to altcoins yet. And that's another way that Binance is probably going to make money. They're going to sucker people in with free Bitcoin trading. And then when people trade altcoins, they're going to make money from the altcoins. So Binance will cut Bitcoin trading fees to zero worldwide as of July 8th. So starting in roughly uh, two days... They're going to turn up the heat on their rivals, which some of them are already in dire straits. And faced with another punch to the mouth from Binance, they might actually just go under. So trading fees are being eliminated across 13 stablecoin and fiat combinations, including BTC, USDT, one of the most popular ones, BTC, USDC, and BTC, BUSD. The cut in fees and extension of a program, the largest cryptocurrency uh, exchange by volume introduced last month in the U.S. So they last month, they Binance.us actually got rid of the fees for BTC trading. Now they're doing it worldwide, puts a lot of heat on especially smaller exchanges, which might live off of the fees. So now people might move from those smaller exchanges to Binance. And with zero fees, it actually might make them more palatable than DEXs, which actually still have a small fee for liquidity providing. So for traders, Binance might be the place to go. Zero fee trading will take effect July 8th to co coincide with the exchange's five-year anniversary this month. It will remain in place until further notice. The move across the global Binance business uh, across the global Binance business follows two weeks after Binance.us removed trading fees on Bitcoin spot pairs. With the onset of the crypto bear market, exchanges like Binance have been seeking ways of attracting and retaining users on their platforms to ensure their slice of the depleted pie remains healthy. Shares of Binance's publicly traded rival Coinbase fell 9.7% June 22nd, the day Binance.us announced free trading. Shares are down 5.8% so far today, while the NASDAQ index has lost less than 0.2%. Coinbase is essentially like getting owned. Um, I think like th some of their customers are probably going over to Binance. And the thing is like with these trading fees, a lot of these global exchanges are going to feel the heat as well. And Binance is just going to get more customers for their other services, which obviously is going to be great for Binance. So I don't know if you're invested in these other exchanges, I take a second look because Binance is turning up the heat. FTX is going to turn up the heat and they might just be bought out. So that's the news for today. Let me know what you think, like, and subscribe, hit that bell notifications button. Thank you and have a nice day.